let's say we have some beginners that have never seen a workflow before. How would you just tell them about Gumloop and like the simplest zero to one to get going? First thing to touch on is we try to simplify how your build and everything so that you can just focus on building workflows. So everything runs through Gumloop credits. By default, all nodes that don't cost us money are free, but the nodes that cost us money, like an Apollo, at Richmond, an AI node, we will charge Gumloop credits for it. And then you can go ahead and make everything cheaper by throwing your own API key in if you wanted to like reduce the credit cost. But when you're using all of these integrations, they are like all, even the Appify ones, we are paying Appify for you and then just letting you pay through Gumloop so you don't have to like have 50 different subscriptions. With our AI nodes, same thing. Like all of these models, are at your disposal, but you're paying through Gumloop. The general approach to automating is uh, the pattern I notice is normally you're reading from somewhere, you're doing some like nuanced manipulation, analysis, extraction, all of like the key things that you would normally be doing are like in our AI categories, so, like data extraction, categorization, image yep. generation, deep research, image analysis, video analysis, and then you're writing it to somewhere that you care about. So it's often that is generally the pattern. All of these sources that you can pull and update and read from and delete from are listed in our integrations here. And then all of the nodes that have MCP on them are the ones that are like super flexible. 